Benefits, Sources, and Deficiencies of Vitamin C. Welcome to our channel. Thank you for visiting today. We appreciate your input, so please leave us a message, comment, or even a question below. Thank you. Typically, we start off our videos with the health benefits of a vitamin, nutrient, or a food source. Today, we will first focus on vitamin C deficiencies and then discuss key roles it plays in the human body and why supplements could be a bad idea. Deficiency or a lack of vitamin C results in the following health conditions. Anemia or low in iron in your blood. Infections. Bleeding gums. Scurvy. Wounds that won't heal. Small blood vessels become fragile and break easily. Muscle loss. Plaque buildup in your arteries. Mental distress. The body requires vitamin C for normal physiological functions and is only found in foods we eat or by credible supplements. The following foods are high in vitamin C. All types of berries. Lemons. Tomatoes. Green leafy vegetables, all types of peppers, organ meat, including liver, broccoli. Vitamin C is water-soluble, so toxicity is rare. C is an, a powerful antioxidant and protects the body from various disease-causing effects of free radicals, toxins, and pollutants. Key factors regarding supplements and the importance of vitamin C. It facilitates the conversion of cholesterol into bile acids, which lowers cholesterol level. Increases the absorption of iron in the gut by reducing ferric into a ferrous state. It enhances vitamin E bioavailability in the body. Helps in the proper synthesis and metabolism of the following. Tyrosine, folic acid, tryptophan, and hydroxylation of glycine, proline, lysine, carnitine, and catecholamine. Enhances collagen synthesis and soft tissue healing. There is an ongoing debate about getting valuable nutrients from whole food sources compared to common synthetic supplements, which are supposed to be chemically the same. This is questionable. 80% of ascorbic acid is manufactured in China which is the most common ingredient in store-bought vitamin C. It is compelling as to why there is always a chemical or synthetic in parentheses on the back of vitamin bottles, as researched by Dr. Burke here on YouTube. If the vitamin, mineral, or amino acid is sourced from food, it is mandated to be listed on the bottle, as well as a synthetic ingredient. Thank you so much for watching today. Please like and subscribe and follow the suggested content for more of our videos and check the links pinned in the comments for healthy diet tips and ideas. Also, please check out Dr. Berg. He has a lot of good information and sources. So thanks again. Bye.